the Back Alley. I'm your host, John. This week we examine a few what now on DVD videos. Let's see what flicks are gonna end up in a Back Alley jump cell. As you can see, the set is still under construction, but I don't give a fuck, and you shouldn't either. Because it's my fucking show, and you're fucking watching it. First up, Chernobyl Diaries. Number four, still there. There is Pripyat. Come to the workers and families of Chernobyl. So, uh, the Chernobyl Diaries. Not exactly something that I would recommend for the kids, but Movie Phone has it at a 63%. Critic score, 32%. I'm gonna side with the critics on this one. It's a fucking sham. All right? Who the fuck is gonna waste $25, go get a fucking Blu-ray copy, go home, and sit and eat popcorn with this fucking movie? I can go bring fucking Cloverfield for $11 in Newberry Comics. All right? Give me a fucking break here. Anyway, so I'm with my broad. You know, we're watching this fucking movie, and I'm starting to think she's from fucking Chernobyl the way she's looking at me. I mean, it's really not fucking fair. This broad getting all scared. I'm sitting here like, this doesn't even fucking look real. Who the fuck are you to get scared? The fucking lights are off. I'm trying to diddle with her. She's having none of it. She's fucking squirming. Whatever. You know what? Skip the fucking movie. Skip the popcorn. Tell her to take a fucking hike. You don't need her. All right, next movie. A king has his reign. And then he dies. Okay, so the next movie is Prometheus. Movie phone 60, critic score 65. I fucking hated it. Ridley Scott does this fucking movie. Apparently, it's like this fucking scary movie. He should stick to fucking Gladiator. All right, fucking get Russell Crowe back in a fucking armored suit, get him back in fucking Rome, or doing fucking Robin Hood, and leave me the fuck alone. I'm supposed to go and buy this fucking movie off this guy? Come on, you're better than this, baby. They're leaving. To go where? Earth. We were so wrong. Take us home! No, stop it! There won't be any home to go back to. It is what it is, so... Thumbs down on Prometheus, thumbs down on Chernobyl Diaries. The next movie's Rock of Ages. Space is about to become a sea of sweat, the air shattering music and puke. So my next movie up for uh, critique is Rock of Ages. Has a movie phone score of 74, critic score of 47, and uh, I have to agree with Movie Phone on this one. I loved it. I'm not gonna lie, I had a few chuckles, it wasn't bad. It was like one of those feel good movies. You know, they're singing, they're dancing, they're doing what the fuck ever. But you know, Alec Baldwin's hilarious. You got your Scientology King Tom Cruise in there. He's doing his thing as Stacy, whoever the fuck he is. This is the greatest night of my life! Ladies and gentlemen, the iPod of Rock! The legendary. I, I can't do it. I don't, I don't know anything about Rock of Ages, dude. Um, you've been watching our first inaugural edition of Back Alley. I'm Johnny. I hope to see you again. I hope you like what I've had to say. But if you don't, who gives a fuck? Okay, this is for me, not for you. Alright? Like, you're acting as if I'm fucking some sort of a fucking Nostradamus. Like, I'm allowed to fucking hand out awards. Alright, if it was up to me, South Park would be getting Best Picture every fucking year. So... And Family Guy needs to come out with their own fucking movie. So bottom line, watch my show, all right? Write me some fucking comments and tell me how I can fucking improve. Other than that, I really don't want to give a fuck who you are. I don't want to hear from you. You suck!